Alright, welcome back to the channel and welcome to Firebox Breaks. Ladies and gentlemen, if this is your first trip to the channel, welcome. We are going to do another episode of Mashup Monday. And for this one, we've got some interesting packs. We are going to do the surprise bag. Well, actually, it's called the Hockey Value Bundle now. And that is from the Pristine Offering obviously coming to us by way of Dollarama. So we also have, and that's for the retro collectors out there, a lot of 90s action in there. So we've got the Toronto Maple Leaf Centennial set right there. We've got 2020-21 Upper Deck Series 2. We have a hobby of Skybox Metal 22-23. Followed up by 23-24, we've got the OPG and Series 2. Of course, you know who the big chase card is in there. We're going to go like that. Going to put it in this particular order here. And we are going to have some fun. But first, let me open up this pristine hockey bundle with the trusty scissors. Off to the side there. Okay, so that is that. That is off the way. And I still need to open up the individual packs that are coming out from there all right so that is the packaging we have two thousands we have a what is that game time three cards right there pristine two thousands we've got 2020 we have the pristine 100 card sleeves that'll be a hit of course and five cards right there so why don't we go in this order here we will cut that open and make it very quick in terms of the pristine hockey bundle. All right, so we are definitely getting into fall. Things are not only falling into place for hockey, but we've got some pretty cool excitement on the channel. I do have some awesome content that I've not opened yet, but I will definitely get to momentarily, of course. Work is busy, just have to find some time. So here we are, we've got the 2020s. We have John Gibson right there from the SP. That is SP Authentic. We have a Nico Heischer from Tim Hortons right there. Pretty cool insert card. And we've got Matthew Kachuk with the other team in Alberta. Here we are, let's open up the 2000s. Well, okay, the scissors did not cut open this one here. It just sort of skim the top all right so that will be fixed of course here we are no massive hits so far we've got a 2000s game time well look at this we've got a miku koivu with the opichi variety we have matt cullen right there and we've got a champs of nicholas Lidstrom. now these are pretty cool cards so that would be the 2015 16 oh this is a 2008 2009 champs Wow, that is definitely going to go in there as a hit card. I think those are pretty cool. These are neat. Some of the marquee rookies are pretty solid looking in this particular offering here for the OPG. And that is the back there. So that one is the 2007-8. Wow, as it did say the 2000s, but that was pretty neat. I didn't expect that whatsoever. But we do have one hit card from Pristine. We've got five cards right here. All right, we've got a Drew Doughty, Pride of Canada. Drew Doughty just recently injured in a preseason game. And one of these Coca-Colas, we've got Dennis Chase. We have a, that one there is Brian Scrudland with the first edition of the Panthers there. We've got the Ducks, that is Randy Lattister and Daniel Sprung. So that is your offering of that particular insert there. Interesting cards, of course. These ones are neat, the older ones. And that there would be Stadium Club. Yeah, top Stadium Club. Look at those throwback unis of the Ducks with the purple. All right, so that's a little bit of blast from the past. We will put those off to the side. And we will continue our regular offering of these packs. Now this the 2017-18 Toronto Centennial set. We have a Bori Salming, 
We have a King Clancy right there. Trophy named after King Clancy. And of course, the Stanley Cup. That one deserves to be a throwback card. Leo Komarov and Ace Bailey right there. So, pretty solid cards for this initial, well, this offering of the Toronto Centennial. But Ace Bailey or King Clancy is definitely going to be featured in the recap. Here we are, third pack in. We've got three packs to go. 22 or 2021 Series 2. Let's see what we can pull from this. We've got, there's a young gun in there. Not exactly sure. That might be a pretty solid one. We have a Tyler Johnson. I'm just moving cards off to the side. We've got a Sam Reinhardt right there. We have a Dominic Kubalik. We have a Evgeny Kuznetsov. Ryan Reeves. Kyle Connor. Jacob Verana, and are we going to get a massive young gun here? This one is probably, nope. Gage Quinney, that is not a massive card, but hey, young gun nonetheless. And that is number 454. We were so close to a Karel Kaprizov, which is 451, but hey, nothing wrong with hitting a young gun. That'll definitely keep our Streak alive with the young guns from various packs. All right, so a Connor Bedard chase right here. I still do not have the marquee rookie of Connor Bedard, but let's see if we can find it here. So we've got Mangia Perni, we've got a Nate Schmidt. Stanislav Svazel, that is your hit card there, so we won't likely get. A Bedard, Comtois, Anderson, Trennan, Merzlikens, and we've got Tyler Johnson right there. Followed up, well, of course, that's where we started. So no Connor Bedard, but we do have a marquee rookie. So far we've got two rookie cards, one being a young gun. And here we are. Can we get a massive card? Well, why don't we save that for the last that is where the young gun of said player is, and I still do not have that. But let's open up this hobby pack. Can we get a PMG? Oh, looks to be like there's going to be a pretty cool card there. Not sure if it's going to be a massive one. We have a Patrice Bergeron. We have a Jake Sanderson rookie card right there. That'll be part of the recap. We've got a Marcus Foligno, and that's how they look in the back. Pretty solid design there with the universe in the back. Lies Lindholm now in Boston. We've got a hey, Tyler Sagan. Oh, it's one of those, uh, forget the oh, aspects or something like that. Jamie Benn and it's okay. It's this way. Green helmet. Is that a Kaprizov? There we are. We, we talked about Kirill Kaprizov and here we are. We do have one. We have a aspects card. I have to double check to see how rare these are. And we all know whose favorite player this one is. Maybe uh, shout out to Julie Farnham. Let me know if you've got that card. I don't collect this set to complete it. It's uh, sort of too high in my books for the price to earn it all. And I think with today's uh, economy, not that I can't afford it, but I just don't think I'm going to spend as much as I've done in the past on trying to collect certain cards. But the Aspects is a pretty solid hit nonetheless so far. But let me know, Julie Farnham, if you don't have that card, I can definitely put that in the package. Send it your way. Here we are. We're going to end up this or wrap up this episode with a Series 2. And this comes to us by way of Gravity Feed Boxes at Shoppers Drug Mart. Can we hit a massive card? That's the objective here today. All right, let's move all these off to the side and see what we get. We have a Mangiapani, as mentioned there earlier, with a different set. We have a Sandheim. We have David Pasternak. We have a Colin Blackwell. We have Travis Boyd there. Jared McCarron. Victor Olofsson. Alex Newhook. And here we are with the hit cards. We've got Luke Phillip. We have a gritty, one of the upper deck portraits, so that's probably a rare pull there. 
And that's not a young gun, that's Drew Doughty. So we are not going to get a young gun. Or we have one of these interesting cards. So Gritty, and then we've got a A.J. Greer, Director of Boards. So there we are. But Gritty definitely is one of the highly sought-after collectibles. Not necessarily a major hit, but I mean it's a rookie. Or a, not a rookie, a mascot. Looking at this rookie card from Glossy. Sort of confused me, but I'm going to put these in the order I think that will definitely give us some payback in terms of what we just opened. And maybe in that particular order, you could let me know. We are going to do a recap and we're doing it right now. I hope you enjoyed the selection. And this is what we pulled here. So... Nicholas Alidstrom Champs, that's one of the throwbacks. We've got King Clancy. We have a Swazel Markey Rookies. Gage Quinney, we've got Luke Phillip right there. Director of Boards, as you just seen. We have a Jake Sanderson Rookie Gritty. Almost the top choice, but I'm going to go with Kirill Kaprizov Aspects. That is your hit of the break. And I hope you enjoyed this particular edition of Mashup Monday. We will try for more hit cards and, of course, the coveted Connor Bedard in a future video. So stay tuned for that. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, stay tuned for all that good stuff here on Firebox Breaks. And we're going to leave it there. So bye for now.